Hello, this is a two minute tutorial on how to land a Boeing 737 using ILS and autopilot. So you need to be on an airport that supports ILS. So if you're on that airport, click M and you'll see the map. The trick here is to change the mode to IFR and then scroll in. When you scroll in, you'll see the cone and click on the cone. And when you click on the, clone, on the cone, you'll see this pop-up. Once you click on these, uh, that will go and pre-populate the instrument in the cockpit. And you're all set. So now all you have to do is do a special start, uh, go 10 miles away from the runway, and land the plane. The way you do it is you go to flight configuration, uh, you click right on the airport there, so click customize, and the trick here is first uh, choose the runway, uh, that's the runway that had the cone and then choose uh, 10 minutes 10 miles from the airport confirm okay load it up okay now here you're loaded up uh, you should pause the pause the simulator and just uh, check on a few things when you activate uh, that's the master switch make sure that's not disengaged uh, that's the disengage state, that's the engage state. So keep it that way. And just two more things you need to do. Uh, turn on auto throttle and then turn on the flight director. And they will show up on the LCD there. And unpause the simulator and click on command. And then click on autopilot. And autopilot is engaged. It will try to uh, align the localizer the last thing left is the glide slope that's not active yet so all right now it's uh, you can see the glide slope is uh, being intercepted as soon as it gets intercepted see it turned to green now uh, it's completely autopilot enabled with ILS approach uh, that's all happy flying